pumpkin. <laughs> Toodaloo! Morning, Cornelius. Here you go. Three pounds of oats to start your day. Twelve inches, one foot. Perfect. Morning, Maddie. Up bright and early, I see. Fresh rhubarb for our Mother's Day pie. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, Mom. These are gorgeous, Matt. Thank you. Wait, where are you going? I was just about to make your breakfast in bed. Gonna have to wait. Got a call from down the road. They have a sick lamb. I need to see what I can do. On Mother's Day? Well, the poor lamb doesn't know it's Mother's Day. I'll be back soon. Oh, must be Mom's surprise. <laughs> they sure like strawberries. Looks that way. Why well, these rescues are even cuter than their pictures? May I? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Wait till Mom finds out we adopted two alpacas. Welcome to your new home. are gone. Unfortunately, yes. We have to find them before Mom gets back. They could be anywhere. Maybe they were hungry. Wait, I remember the driver who brought them was feeding them strawberries, and they liked them. If you're right, I think I know where they could be. <gasps> there they are. Oh, hungry critters, aren't they? Get them. More strawberries, guys? Let's go home. So, what's the surprise? Just keep your eyes closed, Mom. We're almost there. Okay. Open. Alpacas? Happy Mother's Day, Mom. They're for you, hon. I have always wanted an alpaca. Now I have two. Thanks so much. You'll be happy to know we rescued them. Welcome to your forever home. I'm glad you like your gift. There's no better gift than you, Matt. You're the best. Thank you, everybody. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> okay. this already smells good, and we haven't even finished cooking it. <laughs> Noisy snowplow again. It's okay. It's going the other way now. So we let this simmer and... Uh oh Huh? Eh, eh, what now? Now Dad is using the snowblower. Jackie, would you please tell your father? that I am trying to study for my nursing exam and I can't have all this noise up in this house. Got it, Mom. Dad! 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 Oh, sorry, Jackie. I didn't hear you. Mom asked if you would please stop using the snowblower. It's making too much noise and she's trying to study. I know, but it's getting the job done, and I really want to clear the path before it gets dark. Okay. Thanks, Dad. You're the best. Hey, Matt. Hey, Jax. Inez and I are waiting for you. 
Where are you? We're in Botsburg. Where? One for you, and one for me. These will create a lot less noise pollution, not only for mom, but for everyone. You know, shoveling snow is a lot more fun when you do it with your daughter. <laughs> <laughs> Sure is quiet, no. Maybe too quiet? Hmm. <laughs> really? <laughs> Loteria! I win! I win! Oh, hermanita. You didn't win? I never called La Manzana! I don't know what you're talking about, Inez. You definitely called La Manzana. La Escuela, El Perito, and La Sopa. So I win. Ah, oh, Camila, you're not following the rules again. Are you calling me a cheater? I don't know. Are you a cheater? Hola, mis niñas. I got your favorite, buñuelos from the Colombian bakery. Buñuelos! Thanks, Thanks Mama. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is something wrong? We usually only eat buñuelos as a special Saturday morning treat. But today isn't Saturday. <gasps> You're right. What's going on, Mama? What? Your Mama can't get her hijas preciosas as special treats for no reason? Okay, fine. You got me. I brought buñuelos because I need you two to do something for me. Uh-oh. This is not good. Not good at all! Escuchen. I'm going to be working from home a lot more, which means I need an office, which means... Camila, I need you to move in with your sister in her room. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo? But, Mamá, I can't live with Inez. She's so bossy. Well, I can't live with her either. She never follows the rules. There has to be something else we can do. Anything. Lo siento, niñas, pero your papa and I went over it a bunch of times and we've decided there is no better option. Uh, but how are we going to be roommates if we can't even agree on the rules of a game? <sighs> no sé, pero you two are just going to have to find a way to make it work. Okay, muchas gracias. Adios. <sighs> so... How are we going to do this? Uh, here. Hold the measuring tape so we can see how big this room is. How long is it? Uh, 12 feet. Okay. How about the other way? Uh, another 12 feet. Okay. So this is the room. It's 12 feet this way. And 12 feet the other way. And since the length and width are the same, that makes it a perfect square. Why don't we just split the square in half, like this? Then we each get one half of the room. All my stuff will go on one side, and all your stuff will go on the other side. Problem solved. Let's do it. Not so fast, hermana. I'm not cool with this plan. What's wrong with it? I get half, you get half. Fair is fair. But it's not fair. This is my room. I was here first. Let's do it this way. That's cool. Four equal parts. Exactly. I'll take this part, this part, and this part. Wait. That's three parts for you? And only one part for me? Sorry, Camila. I'm the oldest, so I should get a bigger part of the room. But I can't even fit my skateboards into this teeny tiny square. Ugh, this is never gonna work. <sighs> okay, Inez. You can do this. Camila! Yeah? Uh, can we talk? <sighs> I'm listening. 
I want to find a way for us to both be happy. Really? Really. I realized it doesn't matter that I had the room first or if this all feels a little unfair. Mama needs me to share the room with you. So that's what I'm going to do. And how are you going to do that? You know how we split up the room into four parts? Uh, yeah. That was like a second ago. <laughs> well, I'm going to give you two of the four parts. So we'll both have the same amount of space? Yes! Half for you and half for me. You're my favorite sister. I'm your only sister. <laughs> But this room is pretty small. I can't fit all my stuff into half of the space, and I don't think you can either. Nuh uh. Have you seen all my skateboards? So we've still got some things to figure out, like which of our things we'll actually need in here. Well, I need my bed by the window because I get hot and need fresh air. Okay, well, I need my desk close to the outlets so I can plug in my laptop. So, why don't I go on this side? And I'll go to this side. You've got yourself a deal, sister. Yeah! Watch your favorite shows anytime on the PBS Kids video app.